In this video, we are going to see how we can set up a new organization in Zoho Books, especially if you are already working on your trial version on a single company. So let's say that if you want to open any new branch or manage multiple branches, how we can do that. So right now we are working on Elite Traders, which is our current organization. So let's say we want to open up a new organization. So on the top right corner, we have the Elite Traders name. And from here, we can see that this one is active right now because it shows with a tick sign. Under my organization, we only have one currently open. So click on manage. And from here, you can access all of your organization. You can go to the organization you are currently working on. You can just click on the three dots and leave the organization or even delete the company. And also on the right, we have this little blue icon which says new organization. So as you click on that, you can clone the existing settings or you can add a completely new organization. So let's clone the settings because this will pre-configure all the settings but not the records. So click on clone settings and let's write the organization name as uh, new branch, let's say. And the company that we want to clone uh, is Elite Traders. Choose the setting where you wish to clone organizational profile, document templates, email templates, chart of accounts and custom fields. So without data, all of these things will be uh, cloned. And that's a great thing, especially if you want to open a new branch with the same settings, with the same invoice templates, with the same email templates and chart of accounts. So click on clone. It might take some time depending on your internet speed. And once this is cloned, you need to refresh this or just wait for a while until it refreshes automatically. And here we have the new branch open. Uh, if we go to the accountant and click on chart of accounts, you will notice that we have all the things that we have configured intact on a new branch as well. So building at cost, accumulated depreciation of buildings. If you remember, these are all the chart of accounts that we set up along with the account codes. But if we go to sales and customers, we have no customers here because obviously in the new branch, the customers might be different. So they only copy the settings which are common for all the branches. So this is very cool and you can just click on the new branch and you can switch between organizations and manage all on a single place. And on the top right corner, if we click on this new branch option, we have different branches open right here. So we can manage all of them on a single place. And if we go to the manage option, we have this one as default settings. So whenever you access zero from scratch, it will always open Elite Traders. But if you want to make this one as a default company, you can just click on the three dots and make or mark this one as default. So that's how this system works. And even if you want to open a complete brand new organization, you can click on new organization. Let's say that you want to practice on a separate project that's completely different from the existing ones. You can do that here as well. So this is how you can open many companies, many branches in Zoho Books. Just try this by yourself and I'll see you in the next one.